Hello, financial enthusiasts. Buckle up for an electrifying installment of our series, Unlocking the Millionaire Mindset. Today's episode, Mastering the Millionaire's Habits for Success, promises to be a game changer. Ready? Subscribe to the channel and let's dive in. The Blueprint to Wealth You've probably been told the old formula. Study hard, land a great job, and happiness will follow. But let's face it, that equation seems to be missing a few variables, doesn't it? In the past, loyalty to a company meant security. Start young, retire with a gold watch. But today, working for someone else often spells financial strain and a retirement riddled with worry. Here's the deal. The average Joe craves the certainty of a steady paycheck. It feels safe, but it's a mirage. That security is actually a shackle of fear, limiting earnings to the hours clocked. Enter the mindset of the wealthy. They thrive on being rewarded for results, not time. They shun income caps, opting for a slice of the profit pie. This mindset isn't just about money, it's about freedom. Take George Lucas with Star Wars. He could have demanded a higher director's fee, but he played the long game. He traded upfront cash for sequel rights and merchandising a galaxy-brained move. T-shirts, toys, video games, you name it, he profited. Lucas didn't just earn, he built an empire, the moral. To reach the stars, you can't cap your potential. Remember, in the universe of wealth, there are no limits, only possibilities. Keep this etched in your mind as we journey through the cosmos of prosperity together. All right, first let's talk about the morning routines and uncover the gems that set millionaires apart from the crowd. Ever wondered what the first hour of a millionaire's day looks like? Well, grab your notepad because you're about to get some insider secrets. Imagine this. While the rest of the world is hitting the snooze button, successful people are already up and seizing the day. But hey, it's not just about waking up early. It's about what they do with those precious moments. First things first, it's all about jump-starting those engines. Whether it's a quick jog around the block or a few minutes of yoga in the living room, millionaires understand the importance of getting that blood pumping and those endorphins flowing. And let's not forget about the power of the mind. Meditation isn't just for yogis and monks, it's a game changer for anyone looking to conquer the day ahead. So grab a cushion, find your zen zone, and take a few moments to quiet the mind and set your intentions for the day. Now onto the most important meal of the day, breakfast. But we're not talking about grabbing a sugary cereal on the go. No, sir. Millionaires know that fueling their bodies with nutritious foods is key to sustained energy and focus throughout the day. And last, but certainly not least, it's time to tackle the to-do list. Whether it's noting down goals for the day, tackling emails, or planning out strategic moves, millionaires don't waste a single minute. They hit the ground running and set the tone for success from the get-go. So remember, it's not just about what time you wake up, it's about how you make the most of those precious moments before the world wakes up. Now let's talk about smart spending habits, you know? The kind of spender who doesn't just throw money around, but actually makes it work for them. So what's the secret sauce? Well, it's all about being smart with your cash. Imagine you're out shopping and you spot that shiny new gadget you've been eyeing for weeks. Now the impulse might be to whip out your wallet and splurge, right? But hold up. Millionaires have a different approach. Take a page from the playbook of legendary investor Benjamin Graham. He once said, the intelligent investor is a realist who sells to optimists and buys from pessimists. Translation, don't get caught up in the hype. Instead of being swayed by flashy ads or peer pressure, millionaires take a step back and weigh their options. Now let's talk about comparison shopping. Ever heard the phrase, don't buy the first house you see? Well, there's wisdom in those words. Millionaires know the importance of shopping around, whether it's for a new car, a vacation package, or even groceries. Here's an inspiration for you, Sarah Blakely, the founder of Spanx. Back in the day, Sarah was on a mission to find the perfect undergarment to wear under her white pants. Instead of settling for what was already out there, she got creative and invented her own solution. Sarah's story teaches us that sometimes, the best investments come from thinking outside the box and refusing to settle for mediocrity. So next time you're tempted to splurge, channel your inner Sarah and ask yourself, is there a better way? Remember, being a smart spender isn't about depriving yourself. It's about making choices that align with your long-term goals. 
So whether it's skipping that daily latte or hunting for the best deals, every dollar saved is a step closer to financial freedom. All right, now let's dive into the world of side hustles and multiple streams of income. Ever wonder how some people seem to have money flowing in from all directions? Well, it's not magic. It's all about diversifying your income streams. Picture this. While one source of income may bring stability, having multiple streams adds layers of security and opportunity. Imagine this. You're not just relying on that 9 to 5 job. You're also nurturing a side hustle, maybe selling homemade crafts online or freelancing on the side. It's like planting seeds in different fields, ensuring you have a bountiful harvest no matter the weather. Now, let's talk about some practical ideas for starting your own side hustle. Whether it's turning your passion into profit or spotting a gap in the market, there are endless possibilities out there waiting to be explored. And here's where the wealth wisdom mastering the millionaire's habits for success mantra comes into play. By embracing the mindset of seeking out opportunities and taking action, you're already on the path to financial freedom. Remember, it's not about overnight success. It's about consistent effort and dedication. Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither is a successful side hustle. But with persistence and the right mindset, you'll soon find yourself reaping the rewards of your hard work. So whether you're starting small or dreaming big, Never underestimate the power of having multiple streams of income. It's not just about padding your bank account. It's about creating a life of abundance and freedom. By the way, if you're enjoying the video so far and want more topics like this, comment the word wealth wisdom so I know. Now let's talk about networking, but not the boring, stuffy kind. We're diving into how millionaires make connections in their everyday lives. And trust me, it's way more fun than you might think. Imagine this. Instead of handing out business cards at some fancy event, millionaires are out there building real relationships over coffee or lending a hand whenever they can. Yep, it's all about genuine connections. Picture this scenario. You're at your local coffee shop waiting for your latte, and you strike up a conversation with the person next to you. That friendly chat could lead to unexpected opportunities down the road. And here's the thing. Networking isn't just about what you can get. It's about what you can give, too. Millionaires understand the power of reciprocity, and they're always looking for ways to help others succeed. So whether you're chatting with your neighbor over the fence or shooting the breeze with a stranger at the grocery store, remember that every interaction is an opportunity to build connections that could pay off big time in the future. And you don't need to be a slick salesperson or a corporate bigwig to be a networking pro. Just be genuine. Be yourself and be open to the possibilities that come your way. Who knows? Your next big break could be just a conversation away. All right, let's talk about something we all face. Mistakes. Yup, even the big shots, the millionaires, they've had their fair share of slip-ups. But here's the kicker. It's not about the fall. It's about the bounce back. Meet Sarah, our imaginary friend. She's hustling hard but feeling knocked down every time she stumbles. Sound familiar? Yeah. We've all been there. Now picture this, Sarah's at a crossroads. She could throw in the towel, call it quits, or she could take a page from the millionaire playbook. Let's rewind a bit and meet Max, our millionaire mentor. He's been around the block, made his fair share of blunders, but here's the twist. He doesn't see them as failures. He sees them as stepping stones to success. Think of it like this, Sarah sees a mistake as a dead end, a roadblock in her journey. But Max, he sees it as a detour, a chance to reroute and find an even better path forward. Now here's the million dollar question. What's the secret sauce? How does Max turn setbacks into comebacks? It all boils down to perspective. While Sarah beats herself up over every misstep, Max embraces them with open arms. He sees each mistake as a valuable lesson, a nugget of wisdom to carry forward. So here's the takeaway. Whether you're chasing dreams or just trying to make it through the day, remember that mistakes are part of the journey. It's not about avoiding them. It's about how you bounce back stronger than ever. So dust yourself off, learn from those slip-ups, and keep pushing forward. Who knows? You might just surprise yourself with how far you can go. All right, guys, let's talk about something that's near and dear to all of us, our health. 
But hey, you don't need a bottomless bank account to keep yourself in tip-top shape. Nope, now we're diving into how millionaires stay healthy without breaking the bank. While some might think being healthy means shelling out big bucks on fancy gym memberships and organic kale smoothies, millionaires are showing us a different path. It's all about getting creative and finding those budget-friendly hacks that keep you feeling your best. So let's break it down. First up, meal prepping like a boss. Instead of blowing your paycheck on pricey takeout every night, why not spend a little time on the weekend whipping up some nutritious meals that'll last you all week long? Remember what the wise Benjamin Franklin once said, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. Yep, old Ben knew a thing or two about stretching those pennies while keeping yourself healthy as a horse. Now let's talk about getting those endorphins flowing without draining your wallet. Who needs an expensive gym when you've got the great outdoors and your own living room, right? Millionaires are all about those home workouts and outdoor adventures that don't cost a dime. And hey, don't forget about the importance of catching those Zs. Yup, sleep is free, Jize, and it's one of the best investments you can make in your health. So turn off that Netflix marathon and hit the hay a little earlier tonight. So being healthy doesn't have to mean breaking the bank. With a little creativity and some savvy choices, you can stay on top of your health game without blowing your budget. Now let's talk about setting those financial goals. Now I know it might sound a bit daunting, but trust me, it's like building a roadmap to your dream life. So picture this, you've got this big vision of where you want to be financially, right? Maybe it's buying your dream home, traveling the world, or simply retiring comfortably. Whatever it is, setting those goals gives you something to aim for. Now here's the thing, those goals might seem huge at first, like trying to eat a whole pizza in one sitting. But just like tackling that pizza one slice at a time, breaking down your financial goals into smaller, manageable chunks makes them way more digestible. Think of it like this instead of saying, I want to be a millionaire. Break it down into smaller milestones, like saving a certain amount each month or paying off debt. It's those little victories along the way that add up to big success. And here's where our video title comes into play, Mastering the Millionaire's Habits for Success. It's all about adopting those millionaire mindsets and habits to pave your own path to financial freedom. So whether you're scribbling down your goals in a notebook or typing them into a fancy spreadsheet, remember to keep them realistic, measurable, and most importantly, tied to your own dreams and aspirations. All right, guys, let's dive into the world of budgeting and saving like a millionaire. Meet Sarah, our imaginary character for today's story. Now, Sarah isn't your typical penny pincher, but she's eager to learn the ropes of financial savvy from our millionaire mentors. Imagine Sarah hitting the grocery store, armed with her shopping list and a hunger for savings. Now a regular shopper might toss items into their cart without a second thought, but not Sarah. She's channeling her inner millionaire mindset. Instead of grabbing whatever catches her eye, Sarah's comparing prices and hunting for deals like a pro. It's all about maximizing value without sacrificing quality, just like our millionaire role models. Now, imagine Sarah sitting down to plan her monthly budget. While some people might dread crunching numbers, she's tackling it head-on with a sense of empowerment. Instead of letting her money disappear into the abyss of random expenses, Sarah's allocating funds strategically, prioritizing savings and setting aside cash for emergencies. It's all about taking control of her financial future. And let's not forget about that emergency fund, Every millionaire knows the importance of having a safety net. While some might view it as an unnecessary hassle, Sarah's building her financial fortress one dollar at a time. Remember, it's not about how much you earn, but how wisely you manage it that sets you up for success. Now let's talk about something we all do at some point in our lives. Negotiating. Whether it's scoring a better deal on a car or asking for a raise at work, negotiation skills are key to getting what you want. Now, you might think negotiation is all about being super slick or having a silver tongue, but it's really about being prepared and knowing your worth. Think of it like this. You wouldn't go into battle without a plan, right? Same goes for negotiation. Picture this instead of going in blind. Do your homework. Know the value of what you're negotiating for and have a clear idea of what you're willing to compromise on. It's all about being confident and assertive without coming off as pushy. Another thing to keep in mind is the power of silence. Sometimes, staying quiet can speak volumes. 
Don't feel the need to fill every awkward pause with chatter. Let the other person stew a bit and see if they're willing to sweeten the deal. And hey, don't be afraid to walk away if the terms aren't right for you. Remember, you're in control of your own destiny. Sometimes, saying no can open doors to even better opportunities down the road. Negotiation is like a dance. You might stumble a bit at first, but with practice, you'll find your rhythm. So go ahead, put those negotiation skills to the test and watch as you start getting more of what you deserve. Now let's talk about stress management. You know those days when everything feels like it's spinning out of control? Well, millionaires have some pretty nifty tricks up their sleeves for managing stress like a champ. Picture this, you're knee-deep in deadlines, your inbox is overflowing, and your phone won't stop buzzing. Sound familiar? Instead of diving headfirst into panic mode, millionaires have a few tricks to dial down the stress. First up, we've got deep breathing exercises. Now, I know it sounds simple, but trust me, it works wonders. Take a moment to inhale slowly through your nose, feeling your belly expand like a balloon, and then exhale gently through your mouth. It's like hitting the reset button for your brain. Next on the list is mindfulness meditation. Don't worry, you don't need to be a Zen master to give it a whirl. Just find a quiet spot, close your eyes, and focus on your breath. When those pesky thoughts try to creep in, gently guide your mind back to the present moment. It's all about being present and letting go of those worries. And let's not forget about taking short breaks throughout the day. I'm talking mini timeouts to recharge your batteries. Whether it's a quick stroll around the block, a power nap, or even just a few minutes of stretching, giving yourself permission to step away from the chaos can work wonders for your sanity. So the next time life throws you a curveball, remember these stress-busting strategies straight from the Millionaire Playbook. Because when it comes to keeping calm and carrying on, a little mindfulness can go a long way. All right, let's talk about digital detox. You know, in this digital age, it's easy to get sucked into the endless scroll of social media or glued to our devices. But sometimes we got to hit the pause button, right? So picture this instead of being glued to our phones 24-7. Let's talk about the benefits of taking a break and giving our minds a breather. I mean, think about it. When was the last time you went for a walk without checking your notifications every two seconds? Imagine this. By setting some boundaries on our screen time, we're not just giving our eyes a break, but we're also giving our brains a chance to reset. It's like hitting the refresh button on our mental state. So how do we actually do this digital detox thing? Well, it's all about finding what works for you. Whether it's setting aside designated tech-free hours in your day or even just leaving your phone in another room while you unwind, Small steps can make a big difference. And hey, disconnecting doesn't mean missing out on life. It means actually being present for it. So instead of capturing every moment for the gram, let's focus on making memories that we'll cherish forever. So here's the deal. Let's challenge ourselves to unplug every once in a while, even if it's just for a few hours. Trust me, your mind and your soul will thank you for it. It's time to reclaim our time and live in the moment. Now let's talk about investing in yourself, something every millionaire worth their salt swears by. You see, it's not just about stacking up cash in the bank, it's about enriching your mind and expanding your horizons. Picture this, while some people might be content with what they learned in school, millionaires understand that education is a lifelong journey. They're constantly seeking out new knowledge, whether it's through books, online courses, or attending workshops. Think about it. The world is always evolving, and if you're not keeping up, you're falling behind. That's why millionaires make it a priority to stay ahead of the curve, soaking up information like a sponge. Now here's where the wealth wisdom, mastering the millionaire's habits for success, comes into play. It's not just about making money. It's about mastering the habits that lead to success, and investing in self-education is a key part of that equation. Imagine this. Instead of waiting for opportunities to come knocking, they're actively seeking them out, arming themselves with the knowledge and skills needed to seize the day. It's about taking control of your destiny and shaping your own success story. So whether it's picking up a new hobby, learning a new language, or diving deep into a subject that fascinates you, remember that investing in yourself is the best investment you can make. After all, knowledge is power, and with the right tools in your arsenal, there's no limit to what you can achieve. 
All right, guys, let's dive into something truly powerful, gratitude. Now, you might be thinking, what's all the fuss about? Well, let me tell you, it's a game changer. Gratitude isn't just about saying thank you. It's about rewiring your brain for happiness and abundance. Yep, you heard me right. When you take a moment to appreciate the good stuff in your life, magic happens. Picture this. Instead of focusing on what's missing, you're shining a spotlight on what you've got. Whether it's a warm cup of coffee in the morning or a smile from a stranger, there's always something to be thankful for. And here's the kicker. Practicing gratitude isn't just a feel-good exercise. It's backed by science. Studies have shown that people who regularly count their blessings experience lower levels of stress and greater overall happiness. Talk about a win-win. So how can you get started? It's simple, really. Grab yourself a journal or just take a moment each day to reflect on what you're grateful for. It could be as big as landing your dream job or as small as finding a parking spot on a busy day. And here's the beauty of it. The more you practice gratitude, the more goodness you attract into your life. It's like sending out positive vibes to the universe and watching them boomerang right back to you. So, whether you're noting down your blessings or simply taking a mental note, make gratitude a daily habit. Trust me, your future self will thank you for it. Now, let's talk about time blocking for productivity. Now, you might be thinking, what's that? Well, it's like building your own schedule superhero style. Here's the deal. Instead of letting your day run wild like a herd of wild horses, time blocking puts you back in the driver's seat. You get to decide where your time goes and how to make every minute count. Picture this. You grab your trusty calendar or planner and you start to organize your day. Need to crush that big project? Block off a chunk of time just for that. Want to squeeze in a workout? Block it in. But here's the kicker. It's not just about penciling stuff in. It's about committing to it like your life depends on it. When you set aside dedicated time for tasks, you're less likely to get sidetracked by shiny distractions. Now, I know what you're thinking, but what about breaks? Don't worry, we got you covered. Time blocking isn't about grinding yourself into dust. It's about finding that sweet spot between work and play. All right, let's talk about something super important, celebrating those small wins. You see, success isn't just about reaching the big flashy goals. It's about cherishing every tiny victory along the way. Imagine this, you've been grinding away at your goals, putting in the effort day in and day out. And then, bam, you hit a milestone, no matter how small it may seem. Maybe you finally nailed that presentation at work, or you managed to stick to your budget for the month. Now, here's the thing, those small wins, they're not something to brush off or ignore. They're like little sparks of motivation that keep you going when the going gets tough. Picture this, instead of waiting for that big grand finale, take a moment to pat yourself on the back for every step forward. Whether it's treating yourself to a favorite snack or doing a little happy dance in your living room, celebrate those victories no matter how small. And here's the kicker. When you acknowledge and celebrate your small wins, you're actually setting yourself up for even more success down the road. It's like fueling your own fire, keeping that momentum going strong. So next time you reach a milestone, no matter how minor it may seem, take a beat to acknowledge it. You've worked hard for it, and you deserve to revel in that feeling of accomplishment. Trust me, it'll keep you motivated and moving forward on your journey to success. And that's a wrap on Wealth Wisdom, Mastering the Millionaire's Habits for Success. Remember, success isn't just about where you end up. It's about the everyday habits you build along the way. So take these tips, apply them to your life, and watch your wealth grow. Remember, the purpose of this video is to broaden your horizons in the realm of investing. It's not about handing you a ready-to-eat financial meal, but about teaching you how to cook one yourself. Investing comes with its share of risks and uncertainties, so it's crucial to wear your research hat and consult with qualified professionals before making any financial decisions. Keep in mind, past performance in investments is like last year's weather forecast. It doesn't necessarily predict what's going to happen tomorrow. Always weigh the risks and tread carefully when putting your hard-earned money at stake. If you found this video helpful, there's more where that came from. Now, if you want to learn more about the 17 secrets of the rich that the poor ignore from the millionaire mindset, I recommend you watch this video next. Thank you for joining us today.
And don't forget, like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Your engagement is like applause for our efforts, and it motivates us to bring even more valuable content your way. So feel free to drop a comment below. I appreciate your support, and I see you in my next video.